Hello everyone, this is Danny Martinez. Welcome to this short video, another one of our quick feature highlights of Sage HRMS, a complete human resources management solution that helps you improve your data collection and policy management so you can make smart HR decisions for your business. In this session, I'd like to take a few minutes and show you how the Sage HRMS HR actions can work for your organization. If you are using the premium version of Sage HRMS ESS, the Employee Self-Service Portal, you can have the HR Actions module embedded right in single sign-on. So at any time, an employee that has access credentials to the Employee Self-Service, they can log in, perhaps go into their personal record and click on a required action, which would now load this nice HR Actions, what we call the HR Actions dynamic forms checklist. This is a nice area that is clean, concise, and it is employee driven. So the employee can go into a checklist, let's say it's onboarding time, they can now come in and do their I-9. Maybe they need the W-4. Maybe it's up updated information to the direct deposits. Maybe it's performance review time. You need a template for your performance appraisals handbook acknowledgements, confidentiality agreements. Maybe the employee gave you a two week notice and you need some forwarding uh, address information or some offboarding documents. This is the area where we would honestly ditch the paperwork in HR and have the employee come in and fill out a form online electronically. They would simply click the edit action, the form loads, they fill out the information. Maybe they need to upload documentation, driver's license, social security, passport. That embeds in the document. And now the idea of this here is that document now goes for approval within the organization. Example, direct deposit advice is filled out. Uh, uh, direct deposit enrollment is filled out or updated by the employee. That can now go to the payroll guy or gal. They have the information on record. It saves the information in the database, of course, when it's approved, and would now correspond to HRMS payroll and update that EFT information area so we don't have to manually key that information in. So again, a nice area for the employees to come in. No more paperwork. Think of how your organization could customize the view or have your documentation in these checklists. A lot of these areas that I'm, I have here are out of the box. The forms do come with the HR actions. However, you can customize this. Um, another nice feature that I like is manager views. So a manager, if I gave them permission to the HR actions database, I'm still in the employee self-service. I'm now in my manager role in the ESS portal, single sign on right into the HR actions. And now if I truly needed a form, I can come into one of my direct reports and I have permissions to action any of these forms at any given time company property disciplinary action notice. Maybe there's an injury report. This is a nice feature for my organizations that have multiple locations. So instead of having manila envelopes going to this location or to the hub, why not direct that manager or supervisor to the ESS portal, hop into the HR actions and fill out a form electronic. Popular form here is form. So I'm going to load this and show you what the form looks like. I gave this particular manager access to current values of the employee so they can see what they're making, their annual pay, a date, of course, view can be customized. I'm allowing them to come in and maybe change the job, but also update. When I'm finished with this form, this is now going to the HR manager. Perhaps it needs to go to someone else in payroll. Perhaps it needs to go to the CFO or CEO or somebody in the organization for a final approval. Once this is final approved, this information now corresponds and updates the HRMS core record. And if you're using Sage HRMS payroll, that will now correspond and synchronize into the pay code and update that. And remember, this is also creating a historical record so you know who made that change and also an auto log within the HR actions so you can see who made that final approval. Thank you for watching and be sure to watch the many other highlight videos for Sage HRMS Premium.